So you've come, Jim Lawyer. We Team Plasma claim this museum's dragon skull in the name of Pokemon Liberation. To show you we're serious, we'll steer right before your eyes. Watch us multiply. Something about the last surprise. It's time. Is that last surprise? No, that's life will change. Never mind. Persona music. Watch us Something about the last surprise. It is Well then, here's our smoke screen. What's going on? I took the statue, what the fuck? Hey, what is up, all gamers? My name is CDGamer16, and today we are back for another episode of the Pokemon White Randomizer Extreme Luck. In the last episode, we fought all the trainers on the route to the left and did some levels on our Carnivine. So now he's basically on par with the team. And now we're gonna fight N. So, to be safe, I'm gonna put Frog up front since he's the best member. So, yeah, let's do this. Oh, hi, N. I think the voice I was doing was just really fast reading, so... Ah, <sighs> I... Want to see things to know when the kids see? The... Choose the Pokemon inside Pokeballs. The ideals of how trainers should be. And future where Pokemon have become perfect. Do you feel the same? That's so. I think my friends and I should test you to see if you could see this future too. Okay then, then. One of the best rival teams up in here. Cop N. You do be a cop though. Caterpie? Okay, well. You never know. Caterpie could be scary. Gotta stay on guard. I thought Oddish would be easy in the extreme randomizer leaf green. I'm gonna always bring that up, but he was not. I honestly think that like Oddish had like 700 base stat or something. Tentacle. Uh, that is poison, so Bugsy probably isn't the play. If Yagami had an electric move, then 100%. You know what, let's go into Zoe. I know I have really crappy uh, physical attack for Confusion, which yeah, Confusion is physical. I cry every time. I, I was predicting it the entire time, and I noticed that Early on, there was like a Metang that used it, a uh, Confusion on Bonsly, and it did so much damage. So, I should have known from then that that was, that it was physical. Acid. Okay. I see you, big dog. And Confusion did a lot more than I expected. Like, wow. Okay. I guess that tentacles special to And what are you doing, my boy? Why do you have baby Pokemon? Like, I know Clefa could still be scary, but I don't think it even has a move. Maybe Metronome? Pound? Pound it could have. Let's see. I'm going to Thunder Wave it, just to be safe. Always gotta be safe in these scenarios. And then I'm getting Super Sonic, because I honestly don't know how much damage I'll be doing. Copycat. Now, this is where I find out if I get paralyzed. Huh. Well, I guess I know the answer to that now. Uh, Supersonic actually hit. I don't believe it. I really don't. Oh, please don't copycat that too. No, don't do this. Thank you. I would just heal my para, but Probably should have healed my para, huh? What you got? Para? Okay. What the heck is my awful luck? And this Clefa's luck, apparently. Oh my gosh, three times in a row? You gotta be kidding me. Please just get paired. Why? And now I'm confused. Okay. I think I bought, like, a full heal, basically. 
Heal powder here. Nice. Yeah, get out of here. All my stats or statuses that I've been hit with. Yes, keep staying paralyzed. I just want to hit you with one water move. Like, how much is water gun going to do? Okay, that's more than I expected. And now he can't paralyze me. That's a plus side. But he can still confuse me. And he's dead. Thank you. Oh, wow, that gave me no XP. <laughs> Big sad. Right now. My friends aren't strong enough to, uh, to save a Pokemon. Maybe I can solve the equation that will change the world. So I need power. Power enough to make anyone agree with me. Now I, w now I know what power I need. Retro-Ramp. The Legend of Pokemon that alone, along with the hero created at the UFO region. It's my turn to become that hero. And you, I and I will be friends. Is he talking to me or Retro-Ramp? Uh, oh, hang on. I'm researching the Pokemon. Uh, Root Fossil. Sure. I feel like I might need space for this. Wait, oh. I was like, can't leave or something? Swaddle. Okay. That's cool. S not the best, but... Hey, when it evolves, maybe. I think it evolves... Oh, no. Isn't it Friendship? Oh, that's horrible, actually. Okay. I'm gonna put away two Pokemon right now. It won't be official team changes. It, only when I figure out if I want to keep them off the team, will it be official team changes. Because Swaddle isn't the worst, but honestly, I'm fine with Carnivine right now. He has both the moves that would be good on a Swaddle. Come here. Swaddle, okay. So, what do I want to call this thing? I honestly don't know. Uh... Boog. It's a small boog. That's how you know he's boog. Boog. <laughs> there you go. Okay, give me the other Pokemon too. Armor Fossil, what's it gonna be? Hopefully something really good. The fossil you gave me turned into- oh, frick. <laughs> Come on now. Both really bad Pokemon. Like, well, you never know, but I know Hoppy gets literally no moves. So... Looks like a Turnip. I think that's what it's basically supposed to be, so... You know what? I'll just name it a turnip. Where is N? Where is the character known as N? I would not know. Alright, there we go. Let's check these dudes out. Oh, it's level 25. Okay. Light metal. That doesn't really help me in any way. Oh my gosh, that those defenses though. And the speed. Okay, wait. What is bug bite? Physical? Razor leaf? Special? Struggle bug? Physical? Okay. <laughs> we got minus. Okay. Turn up. Your stats are pretty good. It's got Leech Seed. That ain't bad. Mega Drain. Bullet Seed. Sleep Powder. You know, I don't know when this guy evolves, so he could be good. But for now, I'm going to keep my team as is. And maybe, like, in the next episode, I'll have a grinding montage and have my new team. It really depends on what they get and what the next randomization is. Okay. So, Swaddle, get out of here. And Hop up or turn up, get out of here. You know what? Yeah, HM, you can just stick around near the bottom. Because you're an odd one, so the YouTuber, Lama. We have a yeah, no deaths. Okay, eight minutes in, and have you even fought the gym? Nice. Uh, wh who do I have in the lead? Okay, Frog makes sense, but kind of want to try and train up Yagami a bit more. 
And yeah. Okay. Sup, dude? Well, whenever I look at this skeleton, I'm fascinated. Oh, look, it's some random kid. Welcome to my the gym. So here we have a Dragonite. He turned into bones because something hit him and he became bones. Oh, and this is a rock. You like rocks, right? It's kind of like a meteorite. Oh, and here's uh, the Pokemon known as Zekrom. I put him in this weird looking uh, Pokeball. It's pretty cool, actually. Oh yeah, and here's the gym, probably what you came for, so I'm going to stop bothering you now. Have fun, probably lose, Lamel. Alright. Oh. Yo, champ in the making, this is the Pokemon gym. Here, have this fresh water. I know, it's pretty fresh. So, this gym has normally normal types, but now you don't even know what it can have. It's crazy. It's like that's the what a randomizer means. Time to die to my randomized team. Hehe. <laughs> Alright, let's see what this is like. What you got? What you got for me? Uh Ralts. Uh physical move is confusion. Oh at that level it could have magical leaf. And I don't wanna risk that. Oh, yeah, frog. I was like, who do I go into now? Oh, no, no. If that was Mold Breaker, then I'm kind of fricked. Alright, frog. Oh, why? Well, it's probably for the best that I switched, honestly, because I doubt I would have done too much damage. Oh, please stop. Uh, there is only one Pokemon, so I could one-shot it. Yeah, that, that works, too. <laughs> I was going to say I could. Paris song, but nope. One trying it also works. Uh, what is the first one you I think it's this? This is the bookshelf for children's books. Uh, nice to meet you. Would you like to read a book? Oh, okay. There's a note in the back where Lenora is actually hiding, and she tells you to. What is the first Pokemon? I think it's usually Pat Rat, but I'm assuming it's this. Yeah, Biology of Pat Rat. Yeah, this gym is not that hard. You just have to read the last thing. A uh, flame burns. Okay, pretty sure it's this one over here. Uh, flame burns. Wow, that's crazy, bro. Wait, isn't it Tepig? Isn't there a Tepig book? So there's that three. Then go to the one all the way at the bottom right, I think. Almost star. Okay. If I had to grass type, this would be nice. Oh, wait, I do. But no, almost star doesn't get like a bug move. If he does, I'm calling BS. I'm just saying. I know he gets spike cannon, which could be scary. Oh, should use the next special defense. Just saying. Damn. Oh, I don't understand. Why are you buffing your stats? I'm not using that. Bargain, I'm eating that. Yeah. You know, I thought my special defense was bad. Or is it my physical defense? One of the two is bad. Oh, that's all I know. Alright, how you doing? Return to a book. Return a book to the shell. Uh, is this Tepig? Is this a book I can read? It's not this one, is it? Sweets for Pokemon. Okay, it, it, it has to be this one then. Why is fire locomotive? I guess, steam power, yeah. But, okay, that's interesting. But then you go all the way down here. Sweets for Pokemon, and then... Wow, there's a memo in the back. I would have never guessed. Or you could just go to the last bookshelf that exists here. Would have guessed, am I right? Right? Okay. Uh, Swimmer Donut. Donut. <laughs> Swimmer Donut has appeared. Uh, coughing. I'm surprised I have that much HP. <laughs> and that's like, Yagami's normally a very damage type of person. Um, a very health person. For Pokemon, I mean. 
So I guess assurance is most likely physical. Or special, I mean. Because smog did literally nothing. And I know it's not a good move to begin with. It's really only good for poison, which it just did. Am I faster? I am. Did that kill. Thank you. Yeah, I think that's a good place to switch. Uh, yeah, Zoe. Could probably take on Wingle. He's got some nice tackles. Can just go bop, bop, beep, boop, bop. And yeah, enjoy a good time. Go down, Wingle. Or you could eat that hit like a god. Yeah, this is uh, interesting. Oh, th thank you, friend. Friendo. Uh, I know I said this in the like first episode of this week, but the next episode that would be up, I'd be going to school when it's up. Oh god. <laughs> what is? Oh no. Special attack fell and speed went up. Double stop that special. I'm gonna hopefully tank that. Wow, moody. Why? So it's use double slap and what? Let's see. Low kick would probably kill Chansey, but let's see. I can eat double slaps for days. It's special. I have good special defense. If it's a physical move, though, then I'm dead. Special attack rose sharply. Look at that. All right, I'm pretty fast. It should kill, right? He lived on one. Okay, it's double stop. I win. Easy game. Unless you get all crits, then that could be scary. What do you again? Don't boost your speed anymore. Will it outspeed me now? It does. Okay, well. Thank you, Chansey. Very cool. Why do you guys slap my fake tree? What did I ever do to you? Huh, bro? It's just kicking you. Sweeping on. Sweep you up the leg. Okay, so we got to level 17. Nice. Hey, you'll meet the gym leader after you read this book. There's a memo in here. Oh, this is the Tepic book. I thought it was the other one. There's a memo that says, You suck, scrub. Lamau. I like how it takes like a month to open. A ah, hidden, hidden area. Crazy. Okay. Here's the strat. Go heal. <laughs> that's a pretty good plan if I do say so myself okay would you like to restore your Pokemon heck yeah bro there we go now gym leader time I'm hoping it's not that bad but you never know who do I have up front I think it's Yagami if I want to be serious with this, let's not have Yagami up front. Probably Frog. Yeah. The best member of the team. Come on now. Okay. Now. Gym leader time. Kinda worried. But let's do this. Uh, welcome! A director of Nacarine Museum and the Nacarine's Gym Leader, it's me, the Nora. Well then, Challenger, I'm going to research how you battle with the Pokemon you've lovingly raised. Let's kill your Pokemon. Uh, you're actually Joey. So we have Joe and Joey as the normal type Gym Leaders, you know how it'd be. Saucebuck? Ha! <laughs> Grass move, though. Funny. Mold Breaker, though. <laughs> That's what I'm expecting. Uh, I'll Hypnosis. I actually hear Hypnosis? Impossible. I don't believe it. This must be a lie. Okay. I'm gonna go for the Double Slaps, see how much damage that does. How much? Okay, not bad. Okay, not the best either, but hey. Now with that move, I'm starting to see what kind of your blah, 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 blah. <laughs> starting to see what kind of double slapper you are. Okay, and I got a triple slap. The new Pokemon move, triple slap. Ooh, 21. 
Damn son, frog in the good place, Marshdom. Okay, I think M Bugsy can probably take this on. It's def there's definitely a chance a ground move just bops me, but I think Bugsy can take on a Marshdom. I believe in him. So I'm trying to think. It could have Mud Slap, Mud Shot, Tackle, Water Gun. Nothing really better than that though. So if it's really specially defensive, I'm going to find out. Nope, one more should kill it. And I'm eating a Water Gun. Nice. All right. I didn't have to worry as much as I thought I would. There we go. Oh, he lived. That means heal's going to come in. So honestly, I'm going to growth. Alright, super potion, yeah, expected. I'm not sure if a plus one would be enough to kill here. Might get him down to like one health again. Let's see. Oh, never mind, that did less than I expected. Alright, yeah, you got this. I believe in you, Bugsy. You're chilling, taking on these boys. Goodbye, Marsh Tom. Have a fun time. In hell. Nice. <laughs> Alright, Bugsy level 18. Nice soup. Engineer Joey, your theory was correct. I don't know what that said. <laughs> nice. Your fighting style is so enchanting. It is trap. It is trap. I don't, I don't flipping know the girl voice anymore. It is charming. You are a Pokemon worthy of receiving this basic badge. Okay. <laughs> nice. Slap it on the layout. Now. Hopefully I did it perfectly, but... I don't know, I'm not that good of an editor. Even though that should be pretty easy. Uh, protect. Okay, not bad. Retaliate does a lot more damage if an ally fainted the turn before you... you that isn't retaliate. <laughs> Can definitely protect me from retaliate. But what, what? What's going on? Hey, you come too. Oh shit! They took the dragon. Yeah, I think you took the wrong thing, fam. Uh, okay. Well, I guess I'll be ending the episode with a spin of the wheel. Now you wait. Enough fooling around. So you've come, Jim Lear. We Team Plasma claim this museum's dragon skull in the name of Pokemon Liberation. What? What does this have to do with liberating Pokemon? It's already dead. To show you we're serious, we'll steer right before your eyes. Watch us multiply. Something about the last surprise. It's time. Is that last surprise? No, that's life will change. Never mind. Persona music. <laughs> Well then, well then, here's our smoke screen. Go. Get us. Get us. Oh my gosh, this audio. I'm not sure if it's just through my headphones, but the audio's getting oof. What's going on? I took the statue. What the fuck? Good. Ho oh, oh, ho. We have to go after them. Yeah, I bet we do. All right, let's chase him down. Oh ho, good day, Lenora. Find any good fossils to lay to Lear. This is a surprise visit. Are you suffering from Iris Block again? Hey, he's a bird. He may not look like it, but he's those. Because Taylor is just say dreamly, you, you know? That place. No one even likes him. Uh, oh, just looking for a chance of pace. Change of pace, and you just bullied me. I'm, I'm sad. Well, what's up? What's up? Someone just walked away with an exhibit. That's what. Up. Ed, what's going on? Hey, is there some good problem? And those two there, you're your, fr your friends? Bianca and Sharon? Oh, I see. I've read your mind or something. That's crazy. Everyone, Chiaton, Sharon, and Bianca, I want you to stay here at the museum. Who is everyone? Berg and Ed, you two search Pinwheel Forest. Got it, Berg? You showed the way. I'm counting on you, everyone. Oh, where'd she go? Okay. 
Oh, oh, you are it, is it? Are you raring to round up our robbers? Let's go. Oh, oh, Ed, take this with you. It's like a dowsing machine or something. Yeah, have fun with it. It's pretty cool from time to time or something. Now, what did you tell me? Oh, the dowsing machine, like, bites in items. But now, all we need to do is predict the museum, right? Let's go. Hey, wait for me. What the hell, bro? All right. Well, that is definitely a thing. So. Uh. Yeah. I'm going to do a quick cut to the wheel. So, see you guys in a moment. Whop. Alright, and now for the wheel spin. So what am I gonna get? Let's see. What we got? What's that? Wait a minute. Move sets and power oh no. Oh no no no. Okay, well Alright. That ain't bad actually. So basically what that is uh well should be pretty obvious, but it's randomized moves, and I should probably click back on the game. But randomized move sets now. Current, I'll have the same moves, sadly. But it's gonna be randomized moves and PowerPoint. So Bubble Beam might have like five PP. Yikes! <laughs> uh, this could be problematic but yep i uh, guess i'll have to stick around for until the next episode to see what happens so thank you guys all for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe and the next episode i'll be doing the randomizations and yeah i'll see you guys then goodbye